This is Keep the Faith Ministry News. I'm Hal Mayer. 30,000 people, many of them carrying rainbow flags, gathered outside the Legislative Yuan Building in Taipei on December 26 to cheer the passage of two same-sex marriage bills through Legislative Committee. If Taiwan passes these bills, it will be the first nation in Asia to legalize same-sex marriage. One of the bills includes adoption rights. If all goes smoothly, it is expected that they will pass the Legislative Yuan by April or May. But the bill needs social momentum to generate a favorable political climate. Some believe it only has a 50-50 chance of passing considering the social division on the issue. Taiwan is a liberal outpost for gays because over the past several decades, there have been challenges to traditional values on various fronts. Taiwanese are not so bound by traditions, said Hsiao B. Kim, one of the lawmakers. Taiwan is always moving. Eleven cities have already instituted official registration for same-sex couples. Yet the push for same-sex marriage rights has drawn strong resistance from religious groups and sparked a fierce debate in society. Protests have been quite strong. There are approximately 300,000 Christian people in Taiwan, but of course there are other opponents as well. Most supporters for gay marriage are from the younger generation, which want change, while opponents are mostly from conservative religious groups. Likewise also, as it was in the days of Lot, Luke 17, 28. This is Keep the Faith Ministry News. Thank you for watching.